Hi guys, JC here. Welcome back to another edition of Horse Racing Preview. <laughs> guys, this week's fe feature comes to us from the fairgrounds, so that must only mean one thing. Yep, it is time again for the Risen Star Shake. See you guys. This here is race 13 from Fairgrounds. Sounds like they're going to have a busy day. Huh. Set for a mile and the eighth on the main track. Of course, it's restricted to three year olds. And it carries a purse of $400,000. So let's get started right away. And you guys, huh? I am liking Smile Happy to win this one. Now, <laughs> let me tell you why. This horse is, of course, undefeated in his first and only two career starts. Alright? But, I mean, I just love how this horse tends to hang midfield. You know, fifth or sixth place till it's time to move. Then, once it's time to move, he takes that lead in and then it just lights out. Alright? He ain't giving it back, alright? Now, this horse is great at winning by multiple lengths, you know? He won by three and five last time. You know, obviously lost two times up, respectively. Um, you know, he could easily win again. So that's why I got him on top. <laughs> no, seriously, you guys. I am liking Smile Happy to win Saturday. He's got Corey Lannery up. What more could you ask for? <laughs> Moving right along, you guys. I am liking the epicenter to run um, second for you. Now, of course, this horse is probably going to look to go to the front again. Um, you know, he tried to wire him last time out, but he got caught at the wire and he barely lost. Uh, prior to those two starts, he did, he did the wiring, all right? You know, he, he won those races by a combined 10 plus lengths, you guys, seriously. So, Epicenter could obviously possibly run away for, with the show on Saturday and steal it. <laughs> but I do have him running second, you guys. Joel Rosario's up on him. Hmm. Rounding out your top three, I'm liking slow down, Andy. <laughs> he seriously does look like the best of the rest, you guys. I love how this horse seems to be a stocking expert. Alright, I've said before, I will say it again. I love how last time out he hung in fourth, fifth, and it was time to move. And then, of course, he just advanced quickly throughout the race and, and won it. All right? <laughs> I mean, but he hasn't. My little drawback, maybe, on Andy is that he hasn't run for two months. Probably shouldn't be a problem. Maybe. But that's why I've got him running third also, you guys. And Mario Gutierrez is up on him. And, of course, that must mean your JC upset special, huh? Tony Port. You guys, I've said before, and I will say it again, if you like what you see, and I know that you do, please click subscribe, please ring my bell so you never ever miss a video. I'm past my video down the street that someone else is going to like, click, ring, so they never ever miss a video. And don't forget to join me on Facebook, facebook.com slash JC's Horse Racing Preview. You can also find me on Instagram. You can also search JC's Horse Racing Preview there, too. So I'll catch you next week. Bye.